My name is Jonathan Quirk. I am the team leader for the sports team at Guildford Borough Council. The turf tank has been a great addition to our fleet of equipment. We are able to mark out the pitches with much greater accuracy. Our initial mark out is much, much quicker. It's the straightness that is the, the key factor. We can't replicate anything as straight as that by pushing a pedestrian machine by hand, even following a string. And it's provoked a lot of discussion. And they sometimes ask, does that mean people are out of a job? And I can explain to them, no, it's allowing us to do other jobs that were previously being neglected. It has helped because We've, we're now marking out to a much higher standard. That's the first and most important thing. But the fact that we can get on with the little jobs like mowing around the goalposts and even just litter picking, anything that we can be doing when, while the robot's working autonomously is helping improve the standard of presentation of the sites. OK, in the past we, we painted our football pitches, soccer pitches with a pedestrian line marker. The initial mark out was done with strings and tape measures. Previously, it would take two staff four hours minimum to set out a pitch. Now, we, once we've, now we've programmed the pitches into the turf tank, we can turn up on site, select the pitch we want, set the robot going, and 25 minutes later, there's a pitch. I had to do a costing exercise before I was allowed to buy it to prove that it, would, uh, it was competitive with what we were doing already. And we've come out ahead on the cost of buying the machine and so on, and the unexpected benefit is that we are using much less paint than we were previously. We'll save more money in the course of a year than we, than we planned for. We have been buying a number of pedestrian line markers every two years. Turf Tank has a six year warranty, so we've done a comparison over six years. We've said well, the Turf Tank is going to cost us this much for a six year life. In that time, we'd have replaced our pedestrian line markers three times. We've looked at the amount of manpower required to operate the pedestrian line markers and on that basis, the turf tank came out ahead. The fact that we're using less paint wasn't actually calculated in because we didn't know that, but that's an added bonus and that will keep on going year after year. Previously, we were using in the region of 3,750 litres a year. At the present rate of consumption, we're looking to be around about 2,500 litres. Try it, is my first advice. Don't write it off as being too complicated. It might seem difficult at first, but it very quickly becomes well known and the benefits outweigh any disadvantages you might feel you have at the start.